Good morning, guys. It's Monday. Yay. Sorry if you have to go back to work. I know, Mondays are such a drag. I'm trying to make them cheerful for you. But it's 6.30. I'm already up. It's because Kristen had to go meet her mom at the hospital for some kind of something with chemotherapy. Uh, so if you could give a quick prayer for my mother-in-law, I'd appreciate it. Uh, today we're going to be working around the house again. Got to work on the craft room, getting those shelves together and stuff. Work on the office, maybe uh, get ready for some paint. And uh, this afternoon and evening, who knows? But whatever we do, come join us, won't you? Well guys, just got out of the shower and I'm currently uh, uploading some videos or a video from yesterday on YouTube. I'm also uh, backing up everything on my uh, external hard drive here from the past couple months. It's still got a little bit of time to go. It's at 76%. So I'm going to be hanging out here doing this, watching some YouTube this morning, waiting for Kristen to call me, tell me she's coming home so we can figure out what else is going on. Well, hey guys. Things have changed a little bit. Uh, we are out doing some running around for Kristen's mom. Yeah, we gotta go drop off a prescription and go pay her bill and pick up her prescription and take it back. Yeah, everything is, uh, I guess everything went good with surgery. And yeah. So that was good. She got the port in. Um, everything went good, yeah. Yeah, it's just taking longer than I thought it would. Now we gotta do some running around for her, which is fine. Because I gotta get some stuff from the basement of the house anyways. We saw stuff in her basement from when we lived there for a while and we need to get it out of there. We do. So I'm gonna slowly start taking that stuff home. Not only for when we lived there, it was whenever also, um... Jeez. Storage. We just, when we lived in the apartments and stuff, they, there was no storage there, so... Yeah. We threw a lot of stuff down there. <laughs> so we're just, uh, changing our plans. So we'll just make it, as, make it up as we go. We also got to go over uh, your grandma's so you could do her hair today, too. Yay! So we'll squeeze that in there somewhere. Somewhere. Sometime. So we don't know what we're doing, but when we know, we'll let you know. Yeah! So we are back at home in the craft room and getting ready to put together the middle cupboard on the bottom. I'll go right there. Here's the cupboard. Here's the track it hangs on. Here is the shelf. The only thing I don't have is the uh, drawer front because we're not sure if we're going to use it yet or not. We're going to see what it looks like without them first and then see how many we want to cover. There's going to be five all together. A double, a single, and a double. So we're going to put this one together so we see how high we want it. We think we're going to make it a floating. We're not sure yet. So this is more of an experiment. What you going to do? Oh, I didn't know you were recording. Surprise! Hey guys. This is fairly simple. There's a top, a bottom, two sides, and a back. Uh, the instructions are very well written, but really you don't need them. It's, it's a really simple design. You just uh, put it together. Put it together. You screw these in. They click into these right here. You turn them to clamp them, and that's it. Basic. Uh, Simple thing, so we will show you how it's done. So the shell's pretty much done, and I'll go into more detail probably tomorrow on how to assemble them when I do the bigger ones. Super easy. But Kristen's gonna throw the top on. Assuming we get everything lined up right. I will help her real quick. Pigs just slide into the holes. The hardest part's getting the back to set right. And then these right here. Slide in there like so, and you turn them, which I'm not going to do yet. And that's pretty much you do that in four places, and that's how easy these are to put together. So, next time you see it, it will be completely put together. Hey guys, well, guys, the uh, cabinet is put together. However, I need to run to Home Depot either tonight or tomorrow to get some micro bolts uh, because the studs don't line up quite the way they should. So that project is on hold. So instead we are going over to Kristen's grandma's. Yep. So you could cut or style or do whatever style. you do to her hair. <laughs> then we're probably just going to come back home and relax. I know you're not feeling quite 100% so. Not really. I think we'll just take it easy the rest of the night. Uh, we'll probably talk to you some point later today but uh, 
Yeah, that's the plans. Well, guys, we're back at home. Uh, Kirsten's in the other room because she's still not feeling well. Uh, she did her grandma's hair. That took about an hour. And I visited with her dad the whole time. So that was uh, nice. Nice visit with her dad and Kathy. But uh, yeah, we're going to call it a night. Uh, thumbs up if you liked the video. Don't forget, to, don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below. If you're new, you get the, all our uh, videos right to your uh, subscription feed. So that's cool. Also, follow us on our social media. You can find all those links down below. And uh, you guys have a good night. Bye.